All righty. All righty, <laughs> folks. So welcome back to another episode of Strapped In. I'm one of the two hosts, Akuma Nimune, and with me is the other host, Mina Aoyama. Yes, And sir. it's episode two. Didn't think we'd make it this far, but here we are. <laughs> Honestly, this is a huge feat. I'm so proud of us. We did this. <laughs> Yeah, congratulations. I, I, I didn't I, I didn't see, think I'd see the day. I thought we, we would just get lost in translation, but you know, here we are. Yeah, we thought after the first strap, we'd be done. But now we're here for round two. How many, uh, how many of these <laughs> puns do you have lined up? Okay, what if we name the episode like rounds instead of episodes? So like, you know, round one, round <laughs> two. <laughs> you last night being like, oh, this is going to hit. Oh, this one's going to hit. <laughs> This is a misery. You know, um, I'm having way too much fun. Yeah, I could tell. I could tell you are. It's like I'm the only person in this entire thing. I feel like that's having like the most fun with this <laughs> All name. All the editors are just <laughs> drained and then the managers are drained. I'm drained. I put, like, a little happy emoji. Just like, <laughs> da, 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 da. the blushing. Oh, this is, this is the reality that we're living in now. I guess this is this is this is how it's going to be. Um, but outside of that. Congratulations to us on episode one. We yes. are, as of today, it is released. As of today, today, as in March 7th. Yeah, I'm really happy we ended up having it all done by then. Yes, I know. I, I remember mentioning it, I think last week. I'm like, can we have it ready by March 7th? <laughs> me said, let me cook. Let me cook. Let me, <laughs> me going over to my editor, Pengu, being all, Pengu, we need Please. it ready by March 7th. We need it ready. I need him crying. <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> It worked out. I just feel like it's so special to have it on March 7th. So now it's like the anniversary of this show is now March 7th. Yeah, wow. That's... We share a birthday with our baby girl. It's true. And I am i wouldn't want to share it with anybody else. Yeah, exactly. No, I just find out sister. her birthday is not even on March 7th. It's March 8th. I knew it. <laughs> it had to be on a Friday. <laughs> Well, it, the weeks change every year, so or like the days. Yeah, but one of the years could have been on a on a Friday. Oh, damn! You're so right. You're actually so correct. <laughs> um, so I was looking at a bunch of the comments from episode one, and mm -hmm. I just wanted to say that a good seventy percent of the comments <laughs> are strap jokes. <laughs> it makes me so happy. These I'm are yours, so aren't proud. they? They're yours, aren't they? <laughs> I I can't claim all of them. I'm sure some of them are yours. But, yeah, but they're very cute. I like the ones who are like the the comments where they're so excited. I know. The, oh my gosh, I uh, I didn't get to send this to you, but uh, one of the one of the fans that we have, their name is Lumi's Right Hand. Have you seen? They're the one that made that one oh, cute yes, art of us. I have, yeah, I have seen them. Yes, I saw them geeking out over about it. I said, "No oh, way, that's cute. it's real," and that made my heart very happy. Here, let me the let me. way that the moment. We posted like the initial teaser pictures. People already knew immediately what we were talking about. I'm more <laughs> shocked on how the people put the two pictures together of us. I'm not. I mean, like it was the same artist and the backgrounds were the same. Like it wasn't like too big of a stretch. I but mean, that was, like, it was like within like three minutes. Yeah. So it's like, hello, calm down, please. What's up with that timing? They, they stole our they stole our thunder before we were ready for our thunder to be stolen. <laughs> oh, they're never going to guess what we got going on. It's right. It's true, everybody. Mina is uploading a cover. <laughs> you guys were right all along. Um, sure. One day. Just yeah, hold your breath. You're going to be rap line or something. <laughs> You're going to be like the yeah. Irene Bay of, of our I duo. Am, I am kazoo line. So I, I, I do kazoo. everything else. Yes. I'm more. Okay. You know the Pussycat Dolls? Yeah. Oh, it's my God. <laughs> <laughs> and they just tweak her voice to fit like other people but it's all her voice i'm one of the backup people all right and i'm okay with that absolutely <laughs> insane oh good job numi you got this me crying yes dear yes dear <sighs> it, this 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 is our life now it's our life but but i forgot what i was gonna say that you know that's okay it, it happens it, it, it happens it's it does happen but this is the gotcha talk show where we talk about gotcha and yuri and yuri and gotcha and, and gotcha and yuri yeah and and yeah well yeah that is all we talk about huh <laughs> can we talk about your day how's your day <laughs> oh oh my day's been great um i i took a i took it a bit easy since i had a 12 hour stream yesterday oh yeah how was that oh uh, surprisingly really good mm. I, I feel like i had energy the whole way through maybe because there was an end in sight <laughs> 
Yeah, that, that'll do it. <laughs> Were you playing uh, mostly Honkai and stuff? Uh, I played Honkai and then I played Reverse. I finished up the latest chapter that came out in EN. Holy shit, the ending of Reverse. It le- it, it was a cliffhanger. Oh, God, like, not dude, another cliffhanger. Are, are you going to play it or can I, I have do, a spoiler? I do plan on playing it, but I, 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 I is it like a like a spoiler on the same level of of Pentacony type spoiler. Um, it's like a we don't know what's gonna happen, but like no one's confirmed dead. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> I watched a little bit of it, of your stream, and the animations for the talking sequences are phenomenal. Very oh, fluid. It's so pretty, dude. I I am Reverse's biggest fan. I freaking the, I don't just like the animation quality. You could feel a lot of love mm. that's in this game. And and I think that's like it's really important. Yeah, definitely for for gotcha games like that, uh, where you know that the big selling point is how likable the characters are and, and the interactions mm-hmm. and the plot. I completely understand that. Oh yeah, because it's not like a like a simp for kind of game. Mm. It's more of a uh, you're going to get emotionally attached to these characters and you will cry kind of game. Yeah, because there's an apple, isn't there? Ah uh, yes, Mr. Apple. Yeah. There's a dog, too, that's a yeah. six star. Wow. His name is Pickles. You have him, right? I do have him. Is he good? I don't know. I don't use him. <laughs> I use my best girl. I use Regulus. I adore her. I love her. She's the comedic relief in every chapter that she's in, at least. Is that an auto game, too? You can auto it. Mm. They, they added an They listened to feedback and added an <laughs> auto button. <laughs> <laughs> you got so excited right there. Dude, I was so excited because it, it launched without one. So I'm like, shit, I actually have to play the game. Uh, like, it's turn based. So like, it's whatever. But then like, oh, the auto button's so nice. It's so I nice. OK, I just want to put a disclaimer here. I don't want anybody to think that we're lazy as hell or anything I mean, like lazy. that. It's just games like this are perfect for people like us who do a lot of work um, on the computer. And, and we want to yes. have something on, on the sidelines and we want to be able to progress because uh, oftentimes if, if we're not doing that, uh, then, you know, you have to really just dedicate your time to making sure you're mm-hmm. doing everything manually. And that's why we really like the gotcha games where you can actually put it on auto. Like right now, I, I, I've i been doing a sortie on Azure Lane in the background the whole time. <laughs> you're always playing Azure Lane whenever we're talking. Well, you know, I need to level up my girlies. I'm trying to build Anchorage right now. There's there's a part in this game yeah. where uh, you, you can pull for most of the girls. You can get them mm-hmm. by playing the game and going through all of the levels. And then there's another thing that you can do called research in the lab. So you're you're researching these ship girls and you're pretty much building them. You're you're make you're creating these hot women. And yeah. um I have built two ship girls so far, uh Azure and Hindenburg. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. God, I love them. And I'm building my third one right now, and her name is Anchorage. And Wait, you haven't built Atago? I thought that was your favorite. Oh no, you don't you don't build Atago, you pull her. So these are special oh. PR ships that you have to build and it takes time. You have to grind in the game in order uh, to their, get them. They're free to play ones that are just like crazy to get. Yeah, and they're really good. But the the, the, the most recent one, one of them is Hindenburg, the, the mm-hmm. recent one that I got. Oh my God, the blood, sweat and tears that it took <laughs> to get to that woman. Yeah. It, it, it took so much time for me. It took around two and a half weeks, two weeks. What? Of, like of consistent, consistent playing? Yeah, it's all day pretty much because you have to get 2 million EXP for one and then 2 million EXP for another. And it seems pretty intimidating, but if you if you just have it on auto, it'll naturally progress you because you don't they don't they didn't want to make it easy to get these girls. If you want to get an yeah. easy girl, you just roll. This is this is what they do to keep the player base playing. Oh, this is for like the actual like Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, listen. Whaling is the easy way out. I it will one hundred, one hundred percent. Like I, as someone who has spent money in in gacha games, sometimes it's just I, I don't want to grind. I don't want to log in every day, and I don't want to like you yeah. know grind for these mats to get free to play pools. No, it, sometimes my time is it's easier to spend ten dollars. It's true, and that's why I usually end up doing that route. But <laughs> I found out that you can't do it on this route. And this yeah, is yeah, actually yeah. how I ended up liking the game even more. Because before, I was just <laughs> playing it for play. the waifus. But this time, I was like, I have to actually play fuck. And then I, I, I started to play, and I said, wait a minute. It's kind of hits. And I started, like, building them. And I was just kind of cheering a little bit. And then when I yeah. finally built Azure, I, I, I started to tear up because... 
of how much time it took me to, to build her. And then I did the same with Hindenburg and mm -hmm. it was just beautiful. Uh, and right now I'm like doing your it. dedication came to like fruition. Yeah, because I'm not used to it. Because <laughs> I usually just pay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm paying away a lot of the time. That is so sad to say. I I don't always like I'll play the game obviously, but yeah, like yeah, this yeah. one is you it's it's such a different thing, you know, than than mm -hmm. than anything else. And and so I've just learned to do that. And then in doing that, you gain affection points. And so then you can marry them. And it's it's just been a beautiful time. It's so it's like a two for one kind of deal. You build them and you marry them. Yeah, well, the more you use these girls. The, the more the affection points go up. And so by the end of grinding, I have two of my fleets of, of girls uh, yeah. that have a crush on me. And I say, oh my God, this is <laughs> so new to me. I have a harm or whatever. Dude, I don't understand how gacha games are so good at getting the parasocial factor. Because like, I don't think I'm a parasocial person, like in particular, like when it comes to like yeah. streamers, I very much like, you know, there's that boundary or YouTubers, there's that boundary. I understand. Yeah, like, give me an anime girl. She wants me for real, for real. Like, I don't understand. Like, we're in a relationship. Like, me and March 7th, like, we're dating. I don't understand. Like, well, how do they do this? And it's completely fine. I think it's so fine to be parasocial towards your anime <laughs> woman because they're not real. Exactly. <gasps> they're not Dude. real. So they can't yeah, they're hurt not you. Real. And, like, your heart starts, like, hurting. It's just like, they're not. <laughs> it starts crying. <laughs> they're not real. But, you know, that's fine. And uh, I, I was, you know... Finding more reasons to love them even more and more. And uh, mm -hmm. recently they had uh, the new update. And this one is the Russian ship girls. Oh, <gasps> wait, is that the ones that I really like? I'm not sure if you really. I there's I forgot. I always forget her name. Uh, I, distinctly, I, I don't know. I know the skin. The Implacable. The, the I don't outfit. think. Oh, well, this it's one like is one themed. of them. Her name is Sovetsky Soyuz. She's one of them. And then uh, this is the one that I actually jumped oh, looks cool, and, and, and the one sobbed and cried because she was one of the ones that I wanted and I just couldn't get her name is Talon and I got her off stream so I, I yelped uh Talon is one of the other new girls she's oh. wearing a skin yeah um she's cute you really like white-haired characters with a red streak I didn't ex oh yeah okay well this is the thing this is the, here's the thing okay like I didn't think I would enjoy them this much but they're so fucking fine and, and it's a specific a thing they're called iron bloods um, but I don't, I don't think she's an iron blood ship. I think she's just related to one of the girls on iron blood. That's an iron blood. Okay. So she's just like, you know, like a blood writer or whatever. Yeah, I think so. Uh, I, I'm, I might be wrong, but this is the one that you're talking about. It's implacable. I know you love her. I saw that one picture, that one picture of you. <laughs> Me, me between um the, the I was, I was, yeah. Oh God. Yeah. I love her. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. That. This is the one character that's keeping me from um, playing Azure Lane because I will I will spend an ungodly amount on her and I I can't do it. Like, well, I her have to rerun stay isn't for a long time, so you'd be completely okay. No, I'm 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 okay because is it? Are you able to get her on standard banner? No, is there a standard banner? Yeah, but you can't get her unless it's her event right now. The only ultra oh. rares that you can get currently. Uh, that are part of the permanent banner is New Jersey and Shinano, uh, which is... Um, I just like that someone's name is New Jersey. Yeah, they're all named after ships that are also named after states, I guess. <laughs> so Dude, those two are the... Are so, why is there so many like franchises based around ships? Because there's also Toho. You know, probably because oh. there's a lot to go through. And isn't there also like Kantai Collection? Is Kantai ship? I'm like 90% sure there's ships. Okay, I'm going to be see. really honest. And I probably shouldn't Fleet be this girl. honest. Yeah, Enrolled in school. World yeah, the World only... Yeah, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, they're also ships. No, I feel like you might have a similar experience with me. The only reason I know anything about Kantai is the doujins. But that one specific artist, and you know which artist I'm talking about. I think they do Nikomaki doujins. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> That's the only reason I know anything about uh, Kantai. Yeah, and I've known them. For, God, wait, when did that Kantai collection came out? In uh, 2013. So I knew about it since 2013 unintentionally. No, I, I think I got, <laughs> I was reading the Dojins in like 2015 or something. 
But mm-hmm. I didn't know what anything was. This is when I was first getting into, you know, reading manga and anime. And yeah, then yeah, I yeah. saw that. I said, wow, where's... What, see, what manga are they from? They weren't from a manga. They were just from a video game where there's yeah, a bunch yeah. of World War II warship girlies. Yeah, like I saw like the actual like source material. I was like, oh, I'm not that into this. So I just kind of ignored it, but kept reading the doujins. Mm. Yeah. Dude, I was um yesterday, I was looking at the revenue charts for <gasps> how much all the gacha games made. It's ranked ooh, in ooh, February. Wow. And I, okay, so I'm not surprised Hoyoverse, yeah. like Star Rail and Genshin are top two. The, yeah. like, fully, I'm, I expected that. Yeah, same. Love in Deep Space made $44 million not in surprised. February. Not okay, surprised. So that is why I downloaded Love in Deep Space this morning. Because I was curious. I'm like, how the hell did this game make $44 million? I don't understand. I played for an hour. I 100% understand. I've already been tempted like four different times to spend money. I'm holding off because I don't know who I like better yet. So I don't want to spend yet. I spent so like 150. Just- so <laughs> it, w- it was it was a dark night. And, and- what, did you, what did you get? Like, what did you buy? Uh, was it like the- outfits? No. So y- you played through. Okay, guys. Uh, Love and Deep Space is a <laughs> it's like an Otome gotcha game. <laughs> Because okay, listen, mark. I, I was you market to girls. Girls spend money. It's true. You get them parasocial with a with an anime boy. It's game over. It's it's so it's so true. Why? Yeah. So um, it's, <laughs> it's like K-pop girlies. Let me look up the definition of the game. <laughs> I didn't know it was like an actual game. I thought it was just like you go on dates. I didn't know that a there was guns. People, dude, the gameplay is really funny because you're just <laughs> rolling around. And you're like. Bah, 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 bah. I was so confused. I'm like, why are there guns? Why are we <laughs> fighting? I thought this was we're going on dates. Like, what? 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 <laughs> Which one's your favorite so far? I'm I'm stuck between Xavier and Raphael, but I don't know because like I can't even interact with Raphael right now because I'm not far enough in the story. Mm. So right now I'm like with Xavier, but I know I don't like Zane. I don't really like him that much either. He's too, like, serious. And he's, like, a doctor. I don't really care for doctors. Yeah. Raphael's my favorite. I liked how playful he was. By far my favorite. And I spent $150 on his... So I forgot what they're called, but they're special uh, things that you can use for battle. It's, it reminds me of relics, right? Oh. And, uh, but these relics have, have a, a video attached to it. And... <laughs> and yeah. So you know messages. how the way you're holding up the game, it feels like they're looking right at you. <laughs> so I'm holding it. And it's just this one scene of, of him just shirtless on the bed. And then there's another one where you have like a smell on your hand. And then he grabs your hand and he's like, and the way that you smell. Is... Like he's whispering it like that. He's whispering it like that. I understand. And, and he's all, I understand. Me, I, me. I get it. You can't be doing this to me. And I, and I was shocked because I have never seen this kind of fan service in a, in a game like this no, before. They, so HD. Oh, they're not even being subtle. Like, I love that they're just kind of like going for it. Because I feel like oh, a yeah. lot of Ultimate games always like half-ass it in the way hmm. where they don't commit. Like, yeah. I want them to like full commit. Yeah. And they do. And I'm like, huh? Right? I need, I, I need you to call. I love the texting feature. I think it's cute. I know. You need... To commit, if you're gonna do an Atome Atome Gacha game, yeah, I will not feel as connected if there isn't an actual connection between the characters. Uh, yeah, like in Azur, you know how you can oath them. It feels more special that way, it, or it shows when they have a crush on you, when they when they're mm-hmm. getting to know you, and when they like you. I love when they have that. I don't like when it's very just normal tropey and then you never know if it's just very open-ended i i need that definite thing i need that definite thing i need mm-hmm. to see his titties okay um i had you had me in the first half oh i'm sorry yeah you you, you definitely had me in the first half he, he, he's shirtless in one of them and he's all yeah i have a six-pack <laughs> <laughs> what about it you want to touch it like- yeah oh, why are you touching it and then you're squeezing it oh they'll yeah. pudge he says it's not pudge it's my abs <laughs> I like when he tried to touch the crotch. It's like, um, you're not supposed to touch there. Why not? <laughs> Why not, Raphael? Why not? Oh, my God. <laughs> I did get a five star, though. Oh, um, wow. My first ten pull, I think. 
Who was it? Xavier. Mm. So that's why I'm leaning towards him right now, just because I have stuff for him. I don't know how I got Raphael every time. I would have been really pissed if I paid 150 bucks and I got Zayn instead. <laughs> Dude, not not that there's anything. So he's just not mad. my type. He's not my type, but yeah, yeah, he's just not our type. Yeah, normally I love black haired beauties, but but he's just that's a little like, too like, stoic for I me. Like that's like your your girl type, though. It is definitely my girl type. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's 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 the girl type, but like I feel like for the guy type, like I know in my case, I prefer like like puppies. Yeah, I do love puppy puppy guys. <gasps> yeah, Ugh, you're so right. Yeah, or if they're, <laughs> if they're a little, if they have a little bit of hardness to them, but they're all very sweet, like like Gallagher. Gallagher just stood there. We don't know if he's nice yet. I need what do you, you to mean? stop <laughs> acting like you know all of these things. You're just attacking his character when what? you don't know him like I do. He stood there. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's like me saying that, okay, well, who's a character, like a, a female character I really like that it's done nothing? <laughs> what a <laughs> sickening start what a sickening it's like, start. It's like, okay it's like me with robin <laughs> dude she did nothing but die <laughs> spoiler warning <laughs> i love her don't get me wrong okay listen listen when i love her but she's dead yeah i mean it's, it's, it's just the truth <sighs> like when i first saw robin honestly i was i wasn't that like crazy about her mm. it was the white knight music video in mm. that one shot of her in the car because I watched that music, uh, the music video at least like five hundred times, mm. she just kept my affection levels kept going higher and higher for her every single watch. And then all she, she died. did was like look pretty. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well. Yeah. She's probably a lie. Most likely, they can't kill two of them. Okay, you gotta, you gotta pick one. Yeah, it's one or the other. It's one or the yes, other. Yes, one or the other. You can't pick both. That's just that's not acceptable. <laughs> Speaking of which, though, uh, one of the trailers that you told me to watch right away, but I, I was uh, away from home at the time, but then got to watch it was Sparkles trailers. Oh, yes, you finally watched them. I forgot to upload the YouTube video. I didn't know if it would be relevant to upload still, but I did react I would, to all three. I think I I'm going to upload would it tomorrow. Upload it, yeah, They're I wanted to so dedicate good. today to, you know, the podcast, mm -hmm, but mm -hmm. I'll upload it tomorrow. But yeah, what, what were your thoughts? Oh, my God. This made me like I already liked Sparkle because I like an antagonist. Yes. Yes. The the trailers took her to a new level. Yeah, it was. I don't understand where this budget came from. <laughs> Because you would think, according to the Reddit, um, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, but no, like you would think that they would have waited and like really gone all out for Acheron because that's the Ride in May like equivalent, and like we know that the Honkai franchise loves Ride in May, mm, like that's mm. we just Hoyoverse loves May, that's just the thing. So the fact that Sparkle, who's the character right before May, got all of this marketing. I was like, who, like, did she, did she, like, is, did she pretend to be someone in the marketing team? And she's like, um, hey, allocate all the budget to me. <laughs> you know, you're right, though. They do love May. If, if this is the kind of stuff we're getting for Sparkle, I can't even imagine what it's going to be like for the others. She got Dude, three. And May's going to be for the three. anniversary, too. Oh, yeah. 2.1's anniversary patch. So May's coming out or Acheron's coming out with the anniversary. I'm so mad i'm not gonna be home during the anniversary <laughs> i i don't want you to talk about i don't want you to say shit if there if if if, 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 if anything happens oh yeah Actually, you're going to uh week week con, con. right i'm well, so no, okay it should be it should be like the week before that i know so maybe you could carve out time for like an hour because I will the story's try gonna my be best. Good. The story's gonna be good, man. Yeah, the week before on Tuesday. I don't know what I don't know what day of the week. Hey, if anyone from Hoyoverse is watching this right now, um, can you guys please? You don't have to tell us the schedule. I mean, I would like you to, but can you just pick a day of the week when you do updates? Because we've had every day of the week. We've had a Monday update. We've had a Tuesday update. We've had a Wednesday update. And we've had a Thursday. We've even had a Friday update. Can you guys just make up? Just make up I can't get please. over them changing the date last minute. I was so ready one time too. I just, oh my God. I just, I just want to know when, when the updates happen so I can prep my stream. Please. 
Thank you. <laughs> agree hard. Agree. I just I just want to I just want to have something to look forward to, you know, and and, and just prepare myself. There was a, a good what two months of updates yeah, last of a year, consistent. where it was very yeah. consistent, and then you and I were just excitedly waiting together, checking and re- refreshing the Twitter, the YouTube, mm-hmm. and then just cranking out those videos. Where did that go? <laughs> um, they sensed that we were too happy. <laughs> We were we were we were too content. They had to keep us on our toes. Like, you know, the updates have to be gotcha. Every element <laughs> of this process must be gotcha. They had to randomize that and kill woman just just to keep us on our toes. <laughs> okay. okay, to be fair, to be fair. There are a lot more female characters than male characters in Star Rail. Like, and I that think means it's more <laughs> I'm not, I'm not saying that we need to kill them, but but you could just, just send makes, them away for a second. I don't know. I, I just it just like if you killed off like the one guy character in Pentacony, like it's like come on, man. There's only one, and you killed him off. We have like twelve Misha female characters. That important, right? <laughs> Dude, my my theory is is Misha even alive? I don't think he is. He's it's a part of like a dreamscape that nobody else can see but you. Right? Yeah, no one. Um, if you watch through the entire like story again. Mm. Uh, no one ever actually addresses Misha other than Trailblazer. So no one else acknowledges Misha's existence. I want to know so much more about the Trailblazer lore and why we're able to experience. I know they say child like personality lets you see them and stuff. I don't buy it. I don't buy it either. There's something there's something missing in there. Everything Mm -hmm. is crazy. It's crazy. Yeah. Oh, dude. Have you played any of the side quests in Pentacone? Not yet. I do know that. A couple of them are very triggering. Um, yes. Yeah. So I'm excited to play them. Um, yeah, I, I'll refrain from spoilers then. Let me They're just They're really say, good. They're very good. I, I'm very excited. And I did see a couple of your tweets about how sad you were. So I'm excited to play myself. <laughs> if, it's, if, it's, if it's enough to make you sad. <laughs> okay, I get sad relatively easily. I just don't cry. What? Do you? Yeah, I, I feel <laughs> sadness. Okay. Firefly died. I was upset. <laughs> See, but my, my first inclination, instead of, like, being Was upset, other woman. You moved on to your next woman immediately after. And then they killed her off, too! <laughs> and like that's they what knew. happens. They were like, oh, Mina likes Firefly? Kill her. Oh, she also likes Robin? Knock her out, too. Like, this is your fault. I don't know how, but it's your fault. I breathed. You breathe too much. Damn, I need to reduce my, <laughs> my, my air intake, you guys. Yeah, apparently, I'm taking up too much. At least they, they we know that me all Sparkle is, is, is alive and well currently. For um, now. I, the trailer, the music. <gasps> the music I, was so good. It inspired me so really? much. It really did because uh, I really want to make music for Hong Kai Star Rail um, on Numi Plus. And, yeah. and when, I, when I listened to the Sparkle trailer, oh mm-hmm. my God, that shifted something in my brain. <laughs> I, wanted, I, I didn't know who I wanted to make a song about, but it's, yeah. it's, it's, it, it, I'm thinking I want to make something very mischievous and evil. So maybe something towards her or or a, a adventure adventuring Adventure? or huh? <gasps> that'd be so fun. Yeah, or I feel like you could do that really well. I feel like it would match like your voice well to do something mischievous. Yeah, and and oh, Akron, you know uh, how she kind of just switches up. Mm-hmm. You you don't know what what's what's real and what isn't about her because she's so you, you we don't know much about her yet. But but there's something off about her too. Something like off about everyone. Yeah. Oh, did you see? the voice lines that Sparkle has about Black Swan. Getting wrecked by Black Swan. <laughs> <laughs> what, what possessed her to say something like that? So okay, word listen, it like that. Listen, before before Sparkle came out, I was team Acheron Black Swan. I was. I'm like, wow, these two characters are so hot together. I mean, I don't can't trust either of them, but they're both very pretty <laughs> next to each other. So I was I was looking at a lot of fan art of them. Sparkle, Sparkle, this little short demonic creature shows up out of nowhere. Demonic. <laughs> I love her, okay? But all of a sudden, now I'm, I'm Team Black Swan Sparkle. Although I do still appreciate Acheron and, and Black Swan. I would, you know, honestly, all three of them. I saw one fan art with all three of them. I it was wish- really nice. Uh, what's that one fan art? I, w- I, I need to check through my retweets so Pingu can upload it. But uh, the one of Stell in the middle looking at all of the mommies and then Kafka grabs Stell's face. <gasps> Oh, I love that art. That art is my favorite because imagine being still and surrounded by my all of these caring mommies that are just looking after you. Dude, oh, to be still. Still's living everyone's best life. It's but, okay, but is she? No. No. Okay, no, she's but not. You know, you know, like 
doth gives, doth takes, whatever the saying is. Um, she gets hot people around her, but she also deals with death and suffering. That feels like it's a fair horribly trade-off. morbid, Mina. I, I feel like I mean, like, dude, like to to be with Kafka for like a week. I, I yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, what do you need me to do? I, know? I just I miss Kafka. Oh. I can't wait. Do you for think it she's gonna show? I don't know if she's gonna show up this arc. I just, oh. I just, I feel like, I, I feel like it's gonna. I, I think it's, I think it's gonna be a thing where Kafka will come back because I mean, I mean the other Silver Celeron Wolf, hunters are there. Yeah, because the other Celeron hunters are there. Why wouldn't Kafka be there? Like, where yeah. else would she be? <laughs> this is part she's of the script too. <laughs> she's like coat shopping or whatever. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, hey guys, I'll hey be back y'all. later. I was on break. What's up? Uh, okay, when Silver Wolf like showed up to like. The five minutes to leave us a voice message. I got so insanely happy. I I miss love her. Silver. I missed her. She's such a menace. I ugh, she's so fun. Except for when you know she never wants to implant the correct weakness on my characters or on the oh. enemies. I me. Mean, I was doing a mono quantum team. Okay, so like she can only do quantum. Somehow, <gasps> she said no and implanted <laughs> no weakness. It was it was just a black box. She didn't. Impl- she's. It was like quantum or nothing. And she said, "I choose nothing." What did you do to her? <laughs> like, what did you do to her do to make her act this her. way? To- what do you mean? I breathed. I breathed. This she is starting to me. be a little suspicious how these these women just don't want to listen to you. Well, <laughs> I don't listen back, so it's fine. Okay. Okay. Um, that's interesting and cool. <laughs> uh, I, I, I do think that Silver Wolf had a great trailer, but I, Sparkle's... Oh my god! Gotta be my favorite. I don't know how they're gonna top it, dude. They keep power creeping their own trailers, because like first I thought Kafka had the best trailer, like by a long shot. Hers was the best. I ugh. Yeah, and then Black Swans came out, and I'm like, oh shit, this is a contender to be like the same tier as Kafka. And then Sparkle said, nah, I'd win. They just (laughs) released the best trailer to come out yet. Dare I say, Penacony will likely continue this train of incredible trailers. She got three of them too. Does this mean yeah. the others are going to get a bunch too? Like, what? what? Well, like, Black Swan only got two. Adventuring's <laughs> about to get four, and then <laughs> Akron gets doubles. five. <laughs> it's it's like, <laughs> double and pass it on to the next person. <laughs> next one is just a whole YouTube channel dedicated to that. <laughs> Someone's about to get a one-hour animated movie, just like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I would love for them. Okay, so you know how, like, in Honkai Impact, they get, like, cinematics with, like, songs? Yeah, 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 yeah. I want that so badly. Because, like, we started getting some shorts, like, on, on YouTube. Like, mm-hmm. you know, like, the um, like Jing Yuan and Jing Lu stuff. Yeah. I want I want more intense in the game. I don't want it to be outside the game. Like, yeah. I want us to, like, finish a, bo- finish a boss fight. And it's, like, a really hype song. And it's, like, fully, like, like, like the first 2D boss. animation. Yeah. Dude, but I want it to be, f- like, an actual animation sequence. Like, a full one. Mm. And just, like, the way that, it's, like, like, uh... Like chapter the one, nine, like the final lesson. Like I want like that level. The one viral gif of Kiana just getting slammed into a fence. Oh my god, lament of the fallen, my beloved. Uh, they call that Yuri divorce. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we love, we, we love it. We love it when our favorite, our favorite Yuri couple gets divorced and fights and throws benches at each other. But yeah, I want that. Can you imagine Stell fighting? Like I don't know, March because Yuri divorce. I don't want to see March sad, though. But she's going to have to be for character development. I know. Do you think she's going to be next to be heavily developed after? Okay, so selfishly, I want her to because Mm. I I want to see how she develops. Yeah. I feel like from a storytelling perspective, I'd prefer it to be later. I feel like it's too early. Yeah. It's like the way I think they released Kafka too early. I I would have preferred if they made us wait longer. So we, we really want her, you know? I agree, but I I I guess it wouldn't be for a long, long while though. If 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 it ended up happening, and maybe people will get tired of waiting, especially if you see where it went now, because she's not that involved and but hasn't that's been. I, that's why I don't want her. Like I don't want them to just do this so she is involved. I'd rather it be like a more natural progression because like I feel like Black Swan is going to give hints to March seventh, but like I don't want to find out the truth yet because it just feels like the game hasn't been out for a year yet. I want more. Like I feel yeah. like. Because her reveal is what I assume is going to be one of, like, the bigger ones that this game has to offer. Like, one of, like, the big, like, shebangs. And and I want it to be later on. Like, I want I want to feel like we earned it. 
Yeah, I, 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 I don't know how how I would have felt if they if they did make us wait more. You know, our uh, Arla Arla Chino from Genshin. Yep. I mean, I thought she was gonna come out a long time ago. Oh yeah, because the the Fatui villains trailer came out yeah. like years ago. Yeah, and that's I I don't think I'm capable of waiting that long. <laughs> I I just I don't think it's for me. And and so I mean, I, they I'm, made the villain trailer, and we haven't even seen them yet. Yeah, but it's not the same kind of attachment because Arla Chino's been kind of well, popping no, up. But they only like we saw her in that trailer. And then we really didn't see her until uh, Fontaine. Yeah, and even now in Fontaine. I mean, still no, not- they made us, oh, and we're still in 4.0. We're still in the Fords. Like, it's still the same patch. Ugh, waiting is just not for me. I just don't like waiting. They just need to give it to me now. Dude, I need life Gallagher. Just- Where is he? <laughs> um, no, he got confirmed. He's coming out with a veteran. Yeah, yeah. So um, he should be the four star either with Aventurin or Acheron. I it better be with Acheron. I don't want to pull for Aventurin. I feel like it's probably going to be on Aventurin, but uh. but there's probably going to be a rerun. So you could just pull for the rerun character if you don't have like their Eidolons. Yeah, I mean, I'm probably going to get Aventurin, but I, I, I don't think I'm going to. I don't want anything after. I just want to pull him once. But then what yeah. if I pull him first try and then I don't get Gallagher? That's no, what my luck. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> Dude, on Argenti's banner, I wanted one. I did not want Argenti. I didn't. I don't want him. I still don't have him. So I was like, I'll pull on Silverwolf's rerun. Yeah. Because like, if I get another Silverwolf, like it'll it'll just be E one, and that's like whatever. I just want one Hanya though. Just one singular Hanya. Within fifty pulls, I got two five stars and one Hanya. <laughs> <laughs> I was so mad. I I don't think I've been that mad before. But like winning, like just like getting five stars. I, I, okay, can we can we talk about Sparkle's banner? <laughs> can we discuss this? Oh yeah, you're I already laughing. Gonna, I wasn't gonna bring it up because I knew it's gonna hurt you. <laughs> no, it hurts. But what 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 blew my mind was reading the comment section outside of you laughing at me <laughs> was the fact that they they these people that were watching and commenting said yeah. that they have yet to find a content creator that didn't lose the 50-50. I think 97% of content creators lost their 50-50. I lost yeah. mine to Bronya. It, 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 what, what happened here? What, what's going on? It's what? like, no, dude, dude. They they did something with the rates. Uh, this is a joke. I don't know if they did anything with the way. rates. <laughs> I refuse to believe that there is something that wasn't changed. Because how? How is it every content creator? This doesn't add yeah. up. I was you doing know, viewer polls, and we had a bricked counter for how many accounts I bricked. How, how many did you brick? Respectfully, only six out of 12. That's half! <laughs> Plus the 50 50! Dude, my luck only started getting good because it was at like seven out of no, no, it was at like five out of nine. And then um, I I suddenly, suddenly, um, I played Never Gonna Give You Up by Rick Astley. <sighs> and I started winning all the 50 50s. Wow. Because, you know, Elation, who like the mass fools, which are the followers of Elation, mm. with their 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 uh, the, the Eon Aha, mm-hmm. have so many references that they're never gonna let you down. They're never gonna give you up. You're too serious about this. No, you, no, you're legitimately. No, no, like there's full on in the game. There's references to that song. <laughs> like um, you know when Sparkle gave us fuel? Yeah. So the doll, if you clicked it, it's like the Sparkle doll is never gonna give you up. She's never gonna <laughs> let you down. Like she's. Never do you think they tampered with it specifically because of this? <laughs> this? I don't. I don't think they tampered with it. I think we all got unlucky because we this, got too lucky on Black Swan's banner. This is just ridiculous to me. And you know the funny thing is, that I, I said maybe if I play your trailer, it'll give me more luck. Yeah. And then I, mean, I did, did. But I got Bailu. Ooh. At least I and lost you my watched it on your stream and laughed at me. I mean, I was I was supporting you. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, what was, let me. What was that comment you left again? Let me. Let me take a look. Oh uh, no. But I mean, like, listen. As I was typing that comment, I made sure to tell my chat to to be nice. Y- oh, but you. But you can't be. You know, do as I say, not as I do. I. You make me sick. <laughs> LMAO get wrecked. Ooh. <laughs> Why are we here only to suffer? Okay, uh... I was just looking again at the Reddit that you sent. Yeah. So I didn't even realize Dragon Ball and Naruto had gotcha, but uh, Dude, Monster every Strike freaking never heard of anime it. game has a, has a has a gotcha. Okay. Yeah, but it's that successful. That's insane. Dude, Uma Musume, that's the horse game. 
Yeah, but I, I already knew that one was a very popular one. I kind of want to watch the I, I do too. It's kind of cute looking. <laughs> yeah, it looks cute. I gotta want to watch it. Arc oh, there Knights. was one game on this list. It's a little far down. Um, it's called Limbus Company. I watched the trailer on the stream. Uh, hold. Let me look at the number. I I I watched the trailer, dude. There's no numbers. What do you mean? They just have up and downs by like oh. an amount. It's somewhere on the list though. Um, thank you. The trailer, the music was phenomenal wait what's it called it's called limbus company i think i might start it the aesthetics look insane it looks super stylized Ooh. i believe it's a korean gacha game oh dude the music is so good i i'm like i'm legitimately i oh, think i'm gonna pick Steam. it up yeah yeah there's a pc client i think i'm gonna pick it up oh I, i'm actually really interested or i i don't know because i'm looking okay what is it called when they're like this i thought it was turn-based people were telling me it's turn-based it might be turn-based but it makes my it looks, beloved. It kind of looks very cute here. Oh, I think it's turn-based. Mm. I don't I don't know what this is, but it looks very interesting. Arc Knights. I, I uh, highly recommend watching the trailer. It looks it looks I'll amazing. take a I'll take a little look. Ooh, reverse is doing pretty good. Hell yeah. Oh, reverse my beloved. Nike kind of flopped, dude. Yeah, down I do, like, I, I, spot. No, do you not see how much it went down by? Like how much money it went down by? Wow, that's bad. So my I what people were telling me is that like the New Year's event was really good. So people spent a lot. And then like this current banner was a rerun. And that's why it's not doing as well. So it's like mm. the uh, like the lull between like another banger patch. Because mm. you know, like games have to go through that. It, it used to be consistently number one, right? When it first came out. Oh, I don't think it ever beat out Genshin. Really? I, I, I could be wrong. So don't don't hold me to that. But I feel like Genshin's pretty consistently in the top. Yeah. I I heard that a lot of people were losing interest in Nikkei because of uh, there was like a wall that they hit. So they need another big update. Oh, uh, oh, that sucks when that happens. Yeah. I really want to try Blue Archive too. It kind of looks cute. Oh, I've heard a lot about Blue Archive. I, I was considering it, but I remember watching a trailer and the one character I liked from the trailer wasn't playable. So I'm like, screw this. <laughs> 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 So I don't want to play this anymore. <sighs> Love and Deep Space. Five million just in the worldwide global. Yeah, so the global servers. Dude, oh my god. People spend so much money on gotcha games. Hot to name you a colorful stage. Let's go. Let's go. Love that. We're on a rerun banner right now, I believe. <laughs> oh my god. Azur Lane. All of the three of them are, are pretty close uh, for the Japan region, China, and global. Consistently. Everyone Consistently loves their ship just girls. Real and true, real and true. There's so many gacha games. Yeah. So um, many if you go to the last of. one on the list, can you, can you go look at the last one on the list, uh, please? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> These are the games that are announcing uh, they are closing their live services, so they will not be accepting money anymore. <laughs> um, and the bottom <sighs> of the list is Love Live, School Idol Festival 2, Miracle Live, because they announced <laughs> their launch date and their end date on the same tweet. <laughs> down 44 spots that's oh dude they only made ten thousand last month wow what the which makes sense artery gear what Arter oh artery gear i feel like i watched the trailer because i was interested i think it's closing its services and that's why uh it's all oh i think wow. most of these are closing services and that's why they went down oh tact op symphony oh the an i saw the anime for that mm -hmm. it started out very strong but then kind of uh, Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Wow, Artery Gear was doing better globally than in well, Japan. Well, yeah, because um, usually they're not like they have different patches. So like mm -hmm. it might be closing in Japan, but like the global might still be going until like that patch hits. Yeah. So, like you never really know. Girls, I need, I need global reverse players. You guys need to start spending more money in that game, please. <laughs> oh my For god. Me. I think Girls Frontline is the one where they're making a sequel, right? Yeah, they're making a two, and that's why the originals went down. The uh, the oh my gosh that one teaser video was genuinely one of the juiciest looking snippets <laughs> like this girl the way that she turns around is so fluid so mm, beautiful yeah dude gacha games are so dangerous they scare me <laughs> every day i wake up and fear okay you know what game you should try hmm. path to nowhere oh yeah i still need to try that one it's what the fuck it's battle very cats eerie. being <laughs> dude no 
I went on a I went on a, like an adventure finding everything about Battle Cats. This game has been around for over ten years. It has a Switch game. Wow. The graphics have not changed in ten years either, and it is still popping. Wow. Is that not insane? <laughs> anyway, Gosh. our cookie Honkai Star Rail is number one. <laughs> what well, the difference in 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 how much they made compared to just after the top like ten? Dude, it's kind of crazy just how 57. popular Hoyoverse games are though. Yeah, fifty-seven million dollars. Yeah, that's insane. Panacone went crazy. I'm scared to see Acheron's banner sales. You think it's gonna be a lot? I I hope so. I I want. I listen. I know we shouldn't have sympathy for multi-million dollar company, but I want Star Rail to do so well because it's just like I don't know. It's such a special game to my heart, and I just like I want to see it succeed. So seeing it at number one, I'm like I'm like yes, good job. Keep it Dating up. Genshin. That's beautifully. I mean, I wasn't gonna say it, but <laughs> nothing I against like Genshin. Star- but I like it when Star Rail's won. Yeah, I feel just very attached to Honkai Star Rail, especially when you see the when you saw, when you, we looked at the video of the CEO talking about how he felt with with you know Honkai Impact being his his child, mm-hmm. and then moving on to create Genshin, and now Honkai Star Rail. I just get excited when you when when I see things like that because we, they didn't they didn't think it was gonna get this big. Yeah, and it's just like you you feel the love that yeah. comes from Star Rail and like the work that gets put into it, and it's just nice to play a game where you feel like the people making the game like the game. Yeah, yeah. So, ugh, God, good job, Star Rail. Keep it up. <laughs> and can you release another blonde? I'm waiting for that too. I just like like a blonde girl. We get a lot of white haired girls. But like no blonde girls. Where 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 are my blondies at? We have so many white haired girlies now. Yeah, well, how many do we have? Jing Lu, Ranya, Jing Lu. Ran- Ranya's like silver purple though. Yeah, but I I don't know. I kind of put them all in the same sphere. <laughs> <laughs> They're all the same, you know, living their best lives. Real and true. But yeah, the last like true blonde. I feel like was Serval. Serval. Yeah. Is that is she not the only blonde aside from you know Depart? Um. Well, adventure in now. Oh yeah, and Locha. Oh yeah, Locha. So, so we need another blonde girl. We gotta balance this out. Yeah. Like what is? Oh, we have Links. I forgot about her. Oh yeah. So basically, the Landows, <laughs> Locha and adventure in. Like that's it. We live in a society. Yeah. Where's my Durandal XP? Where is she? Where's my Navia? Just put she? Navia. Just put Navia into into Star Rail for me. Make another Navia, <laughs> dude. I I would E six in a heartbeat. I said I wasn't gonna E six. Yeah, it's just Kaka, right? Oh, I have Seely. Oh, you 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 sixed her on her rerun, yeah. So her and Kafka, yeah, ah. and like most of the four stars, I feel like are e sixed. Yeah, I mean that's a, they're just like there, you know. I I I would want to use Gallagher just for a little bit, just just to I think it, hear him listen, talk and grunt, dude. Once you start having like truly built units, like the game's kind of easy, so. It's I, I just use four stars sometimes. Like I'll do a four star run just to make the game more challenging and like mm. try. Like I did, yeah. I did a four star run and I was actually screaming. I think I made it out like with like one person alive and I was like, all right, we did it. Okay, give me my strong <laughs> characters again. <laughs> we did it, we did it. Um I would like to pivot today. Yes. This to to talk about women before we <laughs> sign off today. Yes, our Yuri of the Week. Our Yuri of the Week. Um let me go ahead and send mine over for, for paying goo. Oh, first of all, that trailer, this tweet that I that I sent specifically. Yeah, <laughs> I love more Yuri originals, but why is golf becoming the GL sport? And it's true. Is this not yeah, the second Wing. one? Have you ever watched Birdie Wing? I saw scenes from it. I want to watch it. I feel like I would like it. I probably would too. It's just um, like, it has three seasons, right? You would have thought it would be something like volleyball. <laughs> There is one. How do Connor receive? It's a your it's subtext Yuri volleyball mm, though. Subtext. It's still all sports anime. All of them are gay. <laughs> okay, that's it. Haikyuu gay. What other sports anime are there? Kuroko no Basket. Gay. But I like the main guy with that pink haired girl. Oh, me too. But it's gay. Uh- <laughs> <laughs> I just feel like the BL scene for sports anime is very popular. I don't get why they keep it so, you know, where they don't cross the line and just do it. Oh, there is just one. Just do it. 
there was one tennis anime I watched called Baby Step. And I believe like the guy and the girl got together at the end. Yeah, but it's only for the, the sports anime with the male and female lead. I've yet to yeah. see the stuff with hella crazy tension that is picked up between the audience that never, you know, gets carried through. Subtext! Oh, you know, those sports music anime that heavily, heavily imply and then make them date somebody that they've never spoken to that often. Or when they did, it was nothing but anger. <sighs> he bit you, euphonium. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. I will for ever be salty about that shit. You know what? I'm going to bring up something cute. So my weekly, uh, bi-weekly panel yeah. for Yuri uh, is another. Another one. It's the same manga that I brought up last time mm -hmm. because um, it's it's the Ajisai arc still, guys. I, I'm still in the Ajisai arc. I'm riding I, on it. I am in I am in such a good happy place. Well, <laughs> actually, with the with the ending of the last chapter, not very happy. But um, <laughs> this part was very cute. <laughs> so um, it's 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 Renako going. Hing, she's so cute. It's a perfect score of 500 million again today. I've only been looking at my family and characters from FPS games, so Ajisai is temptation for my eyes. <laughs> if she was a limited character, if she was a limited banner character, I'd wail so hard for her. Oh my god, relatable. Relatable NC right there. Genuinely so <laughs> relatable. And it's true. If they m release any marketable merch of her, I would yeah. get it. I would wail for her. <laughs> if they put her in Onkai Star Rail, E6 immediately. E6 S5 immediately. Just boom into my fucking pocket. I would put tapestry Ooh. above my, on my ceiling. So every time I wake up, I yeah. would get to look at her cute face. Look how cute she is. She's just standing there. It's like, it's like healing your soul. The kind of character that you just you just feel you feel at ease when you look at. Yeah, it's so freaking funny though, dude. <laughs> but I love it. I love like relatable characters when they talk about their gotchas. Like I love it like in manga when you see them like playing love life. It's so true. <laughs> like, it's so I love Renico and and you know so Renico is just obsessed with gacha gaming. Yeah. She was a gamer girl that decided to try to be a little more outgoing when she yeah. became when she like, unrealistic. Moved up. You can do both. You can do both. <laughs> but she managed to become friends with the most popular pretty girls. And she thinks she's very unlikable and, and nerdy and stuff. But all of the girls just love her. Mm -mm. And, and, but but Ajisai... She's perfect. And Renako does not hide how much she loves her. She, oh my god, I would, That's I would like do anything refreshing, for her. That's like refreshing though. It is. It really is. It really it's like is. It's all the, the freaking miscommunication. Like, um, do, 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 you, do you like me? <laughs> It's she like says it got rejected in a dream. Finally, they finally. Oh spoiler, my god! I should have said that. I should have brought that one up too. But that I want a round of applause for the girls. Finally. It's been two years. Two years. I really like the chapter title because, like, the, the oh, series know. title is um, "The Time I Got Re or Our Year We Started with Me Getting Rejected in a Dream," and the most recent chapter's title is "A Couple That Started with Me Getting Rejected in a Dream." I thought that was a very cute little play on the title. I agree. It was very, very cute, and and the way that they carried it out was just so nice. They they got mm -hmm. they got us for, in the first half. Not gonna lie, they did. They they really really okay. So they kissed, and then didn't talk for a whole chapter. I was like, "Are you <laughs> shitting me?" My girl was moping, bro. My girl I was went, moping. I went off myself. <laughs> You I think that your friend's about to confess that you kiss them and then all of a sudden she just stonewalls you? <laughs> Dude, I'm fighting the nearest bridge. It's game over. No. <laughs> like, imagine that. You confess to someone and then they just leave. No call, no text, no nothing. They look at you sadly. <laughs> and then, like, no words get spoken. Oh. <sighs> It's okay, they fixed it. They're, they're they chilling. I'm so it. excited to see the next chapter and how Same. cute they're going to be now. Uh, but that is not the series I chose this week. I chose my trashy favorite for for this week's. I don't even um, think of it as that trashy, though. I just, I it started trashy. It's getting more serious as it's going on. We're getting it's very like well psychological. It, I, yeah, I really like where it's going. It's a very well written psychological. I, I, I wouldn't say trashy, but it, 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 it's it like is the very no chance. You got to get used to. <laughs> <laughs> so it's called um i believe what talk dirty to me yeah that's a, yeah that's the title right and yeah. um it's about these two girls who debut together in a k-pop idol group as a duo 
and one is the president's daughter and the other one is just like a really well liked well received uh very much knows how to play by the books yeah hard working plays by the books but she's like you know mentally just you know a little maybe a little manipulative maybe just like a, like a, like a, like a wee she knows how to play the crowd a bit um love her though and so this 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 uh this, this screenshot um yanhua you're my master they're so I cute couldn't, though i couldn't put anything further yeah <laughs> because it's a smut <laughs> like, yeah Yanwa, though, it's been really nice to see her develop. They did such a good job at it because she started out very sadistic. But as time went on, she started to realize, oh, I actually care about this girl. And but it's, and it's very but it's cute. Like, she's still kind of in denial in a way. Like, I feel like she's a little going bit, through but... her... Something bad's gonna happen soon, and I'm scared. Yeah, yeah I'm so yeah. scared. The first hump is on its way. The tension keeps rising, and I'm just like... Oh no! Oh no! It's just gonna blow up in my face. I'm not ready for this. That's how great. it is with Korean manhwas, dude. Yeah. It, oh it blows up in in a way that you could have never expected. But they're just there's something about Korean yuri. They're so good. They're so it's freaking just, good. I wish there was more translated because I know that there's more out there. Oh, don't even get me started. Oh yeah, yeah. actually, we did mark that down. Translators, please, <laughs> if please. you speak Korean and you translate. Please hit us up. Yes. Uh, strapped in podcast at gmail.com. <laughs> we will pay you. We will pay you to translate these chapters for us. Please. You don't need to post them anywhere. You just need to give it to us. Yeah. We'll, we'll buy the whole volume for you at two yes. times to support, obviously. And then just for, for two Yuri loving strap sisters, you will make us. This just feels like one of those, <laughs> those donate commercials. Please, yeah. we're starving. And we like need flashing some. text in the back on the bottom <laughs> too. <laughs> donate today to save a Yuri deprived person. Like, <laughs> <laughs> please and thank you. Yes, thank please you very up. much. We really, we would really love updates. I spend so much on Gotcha. It would be nice to spend some on Yuri as well. Thank you, oh, dude. I want. An ultimate game Yuri where I can be parasocial. I know, right? I want it so badly. Ugh. One day. We love in deep we space, spread but it. it's just all girls. And like the we, main character is a girl too. So like I my immersion doesn't get broken. At least just let us change the character and, and let them all be just pan or something. So then anybody can enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, yeah, that best of both worlds. I yeah, yeah. I love when they do that. What what's what's one of the yeah, Fire Emblem. Good example. Oh yeah, Fire Emblem. Oh, but I mean, I think they got a little bit better at it, but they do limit your your marriage options, I think, depending a on like, bit, the but, character. You know, all I needed was Edelgard and Byleth. Same, same. <laughs> all dude, Edelgard with like female is it Byleth? I have no idea how to pronounce Byleth. that name. Yeah. They're canon. Like that, that Edelgard's yeah. like, in love with her, like a hundred percent. Like I was so unhealthy about Edelgard. That's one of my favorite things about uh, Fire Emblem and Edelgard is that regardless of what storyline you go with, she canonly loves you and every single yeah. one. I don't, I don't like when you know it's when you when you're a self insert character and you know you can marry anybody, but it's not canon. I love to know what's in the canon and mm -hmm. to know that there's a character that canonly loves you no matter what. It's nice. that's my shit. That is my oh, shit. God, I love games. I love just God. I need another. I have not been as obsessed with the game as I was with um, Fire Emblem, where I, I just locked myself in my room and well, played I feel it like until that's I beat more, it. That's more to do with you had time back then to lock yourself in a room and well, get obsessed with the game. Well, not only that, but it it, I, it was just so good. Yeah. I, I've, I've yet to just fall in love with the story like I have with that. I mean, I do with, with Honkai, but it's a very continuous story. Whereas yeah, that it's one a, was- It's a live playing, service. So like, yeah. yeah. That's how I feel about the Xenoblade franchise. Mm. Whenever a new Xenoblade game comes out, I will never make content on it because that's for me. Like that's that's yeah. my game. Like I need to be by myself in my room with my little Switch and I need to be giggling at the screen because I freaking <laughs> love these characters. <laughs> that was me. That's me with Harvest Moon. Well, <laughs> a story of seasons. Um I I even Rune Factory cuz you can marry you can marry as a yeah. girl in in Rune Factory too and 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 then that makes me happy. I would work hard every day in the mines and come out and, and make some bread for one of my girlies and we yearn for the mines. <laughs> can you marry in Xenoblade Chronicles? Nobody? No, cuz it's just an RPG story. I just really like the story. Mm. I want more sim dating games that are really good. Same. 
where you go on a lifelong journey together. Just, I just mean, like Fire Emblem. You go through everything together and then at the end you can marry. But I want after post-game content where you're living your married life. Like in, like in Story of Seasons, where after mm-hmm. you're married, you can live... 20 freaking years if you want to and you're just still married and happy. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, and random little events happen every so often. Well, I mean, it's like, we, we could just play visual novels like that one Omegaverse visual novel that we played together and there was like a 10-minute <laughs> sex scene. We were I'm trying to figure out how we can even edit life. this. How can we... Guys, Dude, it starts with moaning. Like, you can't even have, like, the beginning prologue in. It's... 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 It might just yeah. have to be like an no, exclusive. No, no, no. The, the, the beginning can make it in, actually. I, I saw it? a video of it on YouTube. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah. I, don't, I know that some of the other scenes cannot. <laughs> like, nope. Um, you guys, if this if, if this series does well enough and, and we eventually make a Patreon, um, we we will put it on. It was four and a half hours of content. That it's we, me that at we... five in the fucking morning. <laughs> also. <laughs> Us at the very end. Well. Have a good night. We stopped narrating by the end. We're just like, we, this is too long. I couldn't narrate that sex scene, bro. I could. I, I was the one narrating every fucking sex scene. I this did the bitch first made, sex scene. It, the, the most tame one. Yeah, good for you. When I started doing it was when they actually started sticking the fingers in. <laughs> and she's just giggling just like that as I'm struggling to read it. I want you guys to just understand and see how horrible that was. Oh my god, it's so it was, it was, funny. So, it was funny. so funny. <laughs> it's truly, truly a gem. I need to watch it back. I have the file. <laughs> like it's so funny. <laughs> you guys want to see that? Uh, you Make know, sure to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. So yeah. That- this does well because you know we want this to do well. Yeah, we're gonna have to start doing some clickbaity titles. Um, we, the first episode was the journey begins. Are you strapped in? And now it's gonna be like, we hate Akron. <laughs> <laughs> what does this mean? Honkai Star Rail is overrated. <laughs> <laughs> Star Rail is better than Genshin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, disclaimer to each their own. That was Just... a joke. I was joking. <laughs> to each their own. We she wasn't joking, but games. I am. and with that i I think that's a great place to end it for this week real and true real and true uh thank you guys so much for being here for episode two episode three there's there's gonna be some actual updates by the oh yeah in the next one one. yeah some actual updates are gonna be happening soon so it'll be very exciting it's gonna be a big one that's gonna be a big episode for 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 the uh for the third record god i hope we can record it fast and have it edited fast oh yeah we'll, we'll try to make it work we'll see what we'll happens try our best. we will try our best to make yes so this episode's actually gonna come out right before yes the- right before um 2.1 goes live I believe. Out, this one's gonna be out on the 21st of march and i believe that's no the week before i think kind of uh the 2.1 2.1 is the 14th it's next week no, 2.1 should be like the 25th. Oh, okay, okay, sick. Okay, cool, yeah, okay. Where's the next, where's the, the week of, I don't know, I don't know the upload schedule. Hey, Honkai, hit me up with what the, whatever the <laughs> upload schedule is. I don't know. Hopefully, uh, after this episode is out, the next time we're going to record will be right after 2.1 so we can give our thoughts, record it. I think we should record it immediately after we finish it and stuff, like just like oh, next God. morning kind of thing. So it's very fresh in fresh. our brains. I'm down. Yeah, all right, cool. So I uh, look forward to that, everybody. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Today was j- definitely more of a general conversation kind of episode. Oh, yeah. Since we're, we're in the middle of all of these updates happening. Um, yes, just talking about other gotcha games as well. Uh, leave, a, leave a comment down below what gotcha games you want us to check out that we can also talk about. Yeah, yeah. Sponsors, you know, we'll if, you wanna, if you want us to play your uh, game, just let us know. Sponsor <laughs> us now so we can play your game and recommend it to people if we like it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank and you. you guys just got strapped. And with that, you've been strapped. I hate it so much. Horrible. Genuinely horrible. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.